Hello everyone, welcome to the channel and this is going to be daily tarot reading guys for the collective April 14, 2018. Three cards spread in the first card is showing up what it is showing up, what we can capitalize on and what is going to help us due April 14, 2018 that is going to be the Emperor card. The second card is showing up the challenges that one needs to overcome during this particular day or in other words what we need to str strain ourselves from this is going to be the four of swords and the last one it is the guidance of the day that will be the knight of pentacles. So the guidance of the day <clears throat> for that particular day it does express our um, standpoint and our attitude guys and uh, here the knight of pentacles is, is pointing where we are scoping a value for ourselves in a sense that we are recognizing a, a very good opportunity during that particular day because the knight sits in front of an empty field empty me meadow if you want to say it that way and um analyzing and scoping out where exactly the knight needs to plant the value the knight finds in order for the value to grow. So that being said, uh, I would say here that during this particular day we can really give up a, uh, give a, a devotion to ourselves, a room to breathe in a sense that we can throw ourselves in, into a, a long lasting um, affair of ours in a sense of a project or in a sense of a relationship as well. Uh, this, uh, this Knight of Pentacles also points that we need to keep the things simple simple without any much of a sophistication which means that in case you're interacting with a, with a person don't try to give them uh, uh, way too much you know um, restrictions or rather conditions but keep the things simple instead of that especially when it uh, when we talk about communication and as well this card it is pointing up that whenever we are about to do um, <clears throat> April 14th it has to be compassionate I mean our actions needs to be compassionate and thus we are going to recognize what is going to be the devotion of ours that we can put on stir during that particular day very important important to be said as well is that if you are feeling under stress, if you are feeling that you cannot handle it anymore, that you cannot stand it anymore, give yourself a little bit of break among nature. Like for example if you are living in New York, let's say, <clears throat> and you have a rough day on uh, in work, then go out into your um, lunch break uh, break uh, have your lunch somewhere in a park among trees etc etc it is very important here because this card points as a guidance points that if you seek recharging of energies that could come through spending time into nature this is going to recharge you as an energy but overall message of this card as a guidance guys is to know your values is to know where your value lies and uh, what devotion you need to put in stir into that particular day and talking in that regard we are going to the card that says what we can capitalize on or what should be our intentions you know what will help us during this day and that is the control we have that is the uh, <clears throat> the competence we do obtain during this uh, into this particular as I said, devotion and agenda. So basically, guys, these couple of cards in conjunction of what we need to strain ourselves from and what we need to do, it says do not slack. Recognize it, grasp it, and start working for it. Because looking at the Emperor, um, uh, those who are not very prone to take on a good, resp a big responsibility, or in other words, those who are... Um, <clears throat> not prone to take on risks and it's not even a risk you know but those who are not prone to be a leaders okay and it always leaves other people to take one for the for the for the team they will not be able to capitalize so it is very important here to be brave to be tenacious and to always seek a way out um, regarding uh, you know the start of this particular agenda here seeking a way out in the sense that seeking a way to put it into stir because the four of swords it does speaks for a constant deliberations about how one thing needs to be done in that particular 
particular case and you may get yourself carried away by those uh, deliberation and uh, deliberations and the whole affair will be constrained into deliberations only and nothing will be done that being said uh, you will never be able to make it perfect you know in a sense you will never you will never be able to plan it perfect or your strategy to be perfect but just like an emperor you need to take on a responsibility for oneself and you need to put a uh, some actions uh, to to uh, you you need to involve some actions into that particular affair not to mention that the emperor wears armor and the armor is a typical symbol of leading battles fights wars and by that being said it will be tough tough deal you know it will be a um a hard thing to put to pull through but in the same time the emperor is a card of authority the emperor is a card of iron hand of a control or and of a full awareness what one needs to do in a, in order to push things through that being said if you do have enough tenacity if you do have enough self esteem you know and enough self belief in that matter um, <clears throat> then there will be nothing that you need to be afraid of guys and you can literally start dealing whatever it is uh, in value or start pushing through whatever it is in value for you during this particular day as i said that could be a relationship of yours as i said that could be a um, a a project of yours as well but what is important here is to believe that it is yours to take and yours only and you will take it because once you start you know once you even capitalized on the idea that you can be either lucrative or happy into one relationship even though through struggle it's not going to be struggle for everybody you know but struggle is very possible you will be able to establish full control upon the situation and through full control upon the situation first of all you will be able to predict what is coming regarding that particular affair second of all you will be able to structure your things in a such way that you will have much more personal freedom and what you need to do or what or rather what you should not do in that particular day again guys is to try to find the easy way out because there is not such path for you at least in that particular affair of big value again saying and uh, to constantly deliberate, uh, de deliberate and searching for the 100% proof way of executing that thing there is no such way at least not for now okay because the universe if you may want to say it that way wants to see how serious and respons responsible enough you are so the universe itself can present you with a, a solid enough um, structure for you to step on and move forward into the future so this day it is not a day for the weak this day is a day for the strongest and they will be able to, um, how can I place it, to take some control upon their fate because this is going to be a full control upon the affair but a some control into your fate what I mean okay so because your fate is uh, is combination of, of many activities combined many things going around and here we're talking just for one of them okay and that one thing it is just yet to start and you are the one who choose where to place it so that being said guys this was the tarot reading for april 14 2018 i hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you are interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video rod signing out now see you next time bye